Good afternoon, Facebook group. I hope everyone has started out well Tuesday. They say that Tuesday is the most productive day of the week. Monday, eh, everyone coming off a weekend. Wednesday, it's hump day. And then Thursday, Friday, people are getting excited for the following weekend and tend to slow down. So I hope you had a very productive Tuesday. It's a few hours to go here on the West Coast. What I want to share with you was the word perspective word perspective. Now there were these two twin boys that were raised by an alcoholic father. Two twin boys that were raised by an alcoholic father. One grew up to be an alcoholic. One of the two boys grew up to be an alcoholic and when they asked him what happened his answer was I watched my father. I watched my father. The other guy grew up, the other son, the other twin grew up and never drank a lick of liquor. Not even an ounce of liquor. He never grew up drinking no liquor at all. And when they asked him what had happened, his answer was exactly the same. I watched my father. Wow, is that powerful. Two boys, same dad, two different perspectives. I thought that was really poignant in terms of laying out when we talk about perspective. Rick Jihad did an amazing job on this morning's General's Call for all of you leaders that are in the same business with me. If you missed it, you should go back and watch it. He does just a great job. He is, he's really grown a, as a distributor, as a team elite now with his wife, Casey Council. But he spoke about imagining tomorrow morning you wake up and the minute you wake up, you have a waitress there handing you a menu. Okay, just the minute you wake up out of bed, she hands you this menu, you open up the menu, and on the left side, it says, you're going to have an amazing day today, Marco. And on the other side, it's going to say, you're going to have an absolutely horrendous day, Marco. I look at those two options, of course I choose, I'm going to have an absolutely amazing day. I give her back the menu, she closes it up, and she goes, fantastic, you're going to have an amazing day, and she walks away. I brush my teeth, I walk downstairs, the stairs behind you here, and as I land at the bottom, I stub my toe and I say, and I scream and curse. The fact that I stub my toe does not indicate that I'm not going to have an amazing day for the rest of the day. I've decided already your thoughts control your actions. That stubbing of my toe and you can relate that to this business, but to any one of us that wake up every day understanding that you're, you control your thoughts, okay? Guard them very carefully. Your thoughts control everything in your day. And if, if I decide to have an amazing day, like uh, Rick Jihas says this morning, that those bumps along the day, that negativity in your business along the day, things that out of left field happen, those are situations that are going to happen, but you've already decided you're going to have a great day. And as a result of that stubbing my toe, okay, after the pain goes away, it's simply going to lead me to having simply an amazing day ahead. So it's all about perspective. I'll keep this Facebook Live short as I got to get back to work upstairs. Perspective. Two twin boys, alcoholic father. When both of them asked, you know, what's going on, one turned into an alcoholic. The other one didn't drink a lick of alcohol. Both those answers were, I watched my father. As a result, two different perspectives. Hope you got some value from this. If you did, comment below. Share your thoughts with me. Hope you have a good rest of your Tuesday. And God willing, we'll see you tomorrow, Wednesday. Bye-bye.